As we bring you impactful stories during April's Autism Awareness and Acceptance Month, we are shining a light on a local tasty business. Yeah, and it's such a great story. Fox 5's Alani Latang is live for us in Scripps Ranch to introduce us to the business and the people behind it. And this is a sweet recipe for success. Alani. It is a sweet recipe for success and a lot of indulgence, if I do say so myself. So we're talking about a cookie business, and the business is done by a mother and son. The mother, Laura, she does all the baking, and Ollie, the son, does all the artwork for the business. Ollie has autism, and he has limited speech, so his drawings really speak loudly to the talent that he has. And coming out here and selling those cookies and sharing stories of inspiration is really what makes the business special to them. So it all happens actually pretty fast. And it's off to baking for Ollie's Cookies, a mother and son business. Uh, hardest thing is remembering to set the timer. It's been little by little. I've completely converted my home kitchen into an office. <laughs> we have, um, you know, extra refrigerators, extra freezers, um, shelving. Mother Laura Bach bakes the cookies. There's eight different plant-based options from chocolate chip to snickerdoodle to the most popular lemoncello. It, it takes me um, about three hours to make about 500 cookies. And um, we bake one cookie tray at a time. We're just about ready to invest in a, a bigger oven. Nine-year-old Ollie does all the artwork for the cookie bags. Oh, Dad. He feels really good. He feels, um, I think, very proud of our product. He feels special. Um, that his name's on it. I mean, the kid has always been incredibly artistic and he is so gifted. Uh, Behind each package dozen is Ollie and Laura's story. Laura left her job of 20 years as a chef when Ollie got diagnosed with autism at three years old. Autism or autism spectrum disorder is defined as a broad range of conditions related to brain development. It can impact speech, social interactions, plus behavior. Laura says Ollie needs 24 hour protective care. He has to hold my hand all the time. I mean, it's it's definitely like one on one constant care between school, behavioral therapy three times a week, speech therapy twice, plus baseball, soccer, swim lessons. Laura said she needed to find a business to support them. So came Ollie's Cookies in November 2022. I tell you, it's it's everything to me. It's everything to be able to um, do what I love to take Ollie's art and and show it to the world. Um, Laura and Ollie are showing and selling at a store in Poway called Blissful Seeds. They sell art from people on the spectrum. Laura and Ollie also sell online in addition to farmers markets in Cardiff, Lucadia, plus Scripps Ranch. I'm not vegan, but their cookies is so good. I absolutely love talking to people about autism. I love telling our story and hearing about theirs. I have um, people wanting to thank me for just being there, for being a safe place, and that's everything to me. Laura's long-term goal is to eventually employ people that are on the spectrum to work for Ollie's Cookies, and she'll be selling here at Scripps Ranch Farmer's Market until 7.30 today, but she sells at other farmer's markets in the county. We'll make sure to post a list on our website at fox5sandiego.com. Andrew, Kathleen. All right, Alani, do tell, what is your favorite batch that you've, uh, you know, as a reporter, taste-tested for the good of the public? <laughs> You know I had to, to give you guys the best information. <laughs> so my favorite flavor is the lemoncello flavor. It's the perfect level of zest and tartness, mm. but I would say a close second is definitely the chocolate chip cookies, which is Ollie's favorite. You bite into it and it just melts in your mouth. We trust you, Alani, but we maybe should try some for ourselves <laughs> just to make sure. Yeah. yeah. Really cool story and uh, an amazing uh, family that's doing some really great stuff. I know. Really great. Hopefully a lot of folks support them. Way to face a challenge and, and turn it into something just absolutely exceptional and, and something to be admired and enjoyed. <laughs> All right, Alani, thank you so much for that live yes. report.